good morning class how are you all fine good so now let's start with our classes you all are well prepared for today's class so the first period is english class english period and all of you need to take out your notebooks so today we are going to do work in our notebook so take out your english notebook and what we are going to do today today we are going to write examples you remember we have done x sound words x sound words kiye the humne so today we are going to do this work in our notebook okay so what do you have to do first understand the words how you have to do the work after that i will give you to do this work in your notebook clear all so now what is the date today today is 15th july 2020 yes so the date is 15th july 2020 and the day is wednesday so the day is wednesday because yesterday was tuesday so today is wednesday yes and what we are going to do we are going to write x sound words in our notebook okay so shall we start with our work so first you have to identify the pictures see i have drawn some pictures here you have to identify these pictures aap in pictures ko identify karoge then you will tell me which are the sounds blending together when we need to write the name of this picture so the very first picture here is yes tell me we have done in our previous class also so tell me what is this picture this is leg what is this picture leg so how we are going to write tell me blend the sounds l and leg so which is the first sound l so how we are going to write now we have to write it cursive format which format you are going to use cursive so let's begin our work l a l see i have written in the four lines proper four line format red line then two blue lines and one red line so you have to follow this format when you are doing your work in book or in notebook so is it clear leg this word needs to be written four times how you are going to do this work you are going to write it four times so again we are going to say l egg leg don't say l e g leg no that is wrong whenever we are writing we are going to say with sounds only say as i am saying l egg leg again l egg leg now what is this next picture yes i told you that we use this to store liquids water hum isme bhar sakte hain we can store juices also when we are traveling out hum isme pani bhar ke le jate hain so who will tell me what is this picture tell me the name of this picture yes <coughs> sorry tell me the name of this picture cake c a k cake so how we are going to write it k a k k so let's start mixing the sounds so the first sound is k so i'm going to write it k a k k again k a k k once again we'll write k a k 
so don't go beyond the red line k a k clear everyone how we have written this word what is this k so k a k k a k now what is this egg egg to g thoda sa long stretch ho raha hai so what we have to do first we are going to write then one more g because g is going little long egg Clear? So I just write it here. Do this 
in your english notebook okay in your notebook so how you are going to do this how you are going to do this work you will open the page a fresh page like this i'll just show you i have a book here notebook here so you will open a fresh page like this in the corner You are going to write today's date. यहाँ पे आप corner में date mention करेंगे. Then in the first line here, the very first line you will write the topic. So what is the topic? Topic is egg sound words. What is our topic? Egg sound words. You will write these egg sound words. Then you are going to draw these pictures also. ठीक है? Try to draw them. I'm not saying draw as they are, but try to draw these pictures for your reference. You can also see these pictures from your book. आपके book में भी है. In the previous class, we have done this work in book na. So you can refer from book also. Try to draw these pictures and write this work like this only in the cursive format in your notebook. So whenever you are doing your work. टेक योर टाइम डोंट बी इन अरी टू कंप्लीट आप अपना टाइम लीजिए बट द वर्क नीड्स टू बी डन इन अ नीट एंड क्लीन हैंड राइटिंग यू हैव टू बी वेरी केयरफुल वाइल डूइंग दीज फॉर्मेशन जब आप लेटर की फॉर्मेशन करते हैं वेन यू आर फॉर्मिंग द लेटर्स यू हैव टू बी वेरी केयरफुल ओके क्लास सो जस्ट डू योर वर्क इन नीट एंड क्लीन हैंड राइटिंग सो वेन यू विल बी इन अ प्रैक्टिस ऑफ राइटिंग neatly uh, in other classes also that that going to bring you a lot of benefits clear so work should be done in a neat and clean handwriting do your work please try to draw pictures also color them write the words and share your work with me clear till then keep on revising all the previously done sounds also as well as this sound also bye all take care meet soon again